Hey guys, Mr. B here again, and uh, bring you another lovely math video. This one on multiplying powers to follow up my other videos on exponent laws. So, you might have something like this and seen this something like this in uh, your class, probably in junior high, I would imagine. And you have two powers with the same base, so I got both base 5, and with different exponents. So how we simplify this and write it as a single power is we have to add the exponents. So when we're multiplying, we add the exponents. So this becomes 5 to the 2 plus 4. And that ends up becoming 5 to the 6. So another example of that might be, let's just use 2 to the 3 times 2 to the 1. And that becomes 2 to the 4. Just add the exponents, 2 to the 4. So it's a really, really straightforward law, but it's, it's very, very important. So you may even see it with variables, so something like this. Um, x to the 3 times x to the 6, so it's no different. x to the 3 plus 6 is x to the 9. So you keep you reduce it down to one base and you add the exponents. So sometimes they get a little bit more complicated. Sometimes you might have a couple different bases in them. So you might have something like this. Um, a to the 7, b to the 2, times a to the 3, b to the 2. So in this case, what we have to do is we have to look up what are our like bases. So the a's are the same and the b's are the same. So we have to combine those. So what we do is we, we're multiplying this. It's all multiply, so it becomes a to the 7 plus 3 times b to the 2 plus 2 so that ends up being a to the 10 times b to the 4 so guys I hope this helps and uh, this is uh, your multiplying powers with the same base you add the exponents so if you have any questions feel free to ask it's a pretty short video but it's still to the point uh, thanks for watching good luck